I've been asked to introduce the key that I've made for helping us open roller bottles and sample bottles. And the story started when I went to teach a rollerball class, and I had quite a few students. And the roller balls are made such that you can't press on the roller ball or you'll break it, the plastic ones. And so you have to wiggle in the roller ball and it just doesn't want to go. And so after pushing in and prying out with my fingers about 40 roller balls, my fingers were very, very sore. So I went to my spouse and I said, I need a piece of plastic with a hole in the middle that will fit right over this so that I can press it down and put it in without hurting my fingers. And so he made that for me. And then the hole didn't help pry it off. So he created a second step for us, which is the crescent. And you slip it right under and push down. And instantly the roller ball goes up. And your fingers, when you're done with this process, are still very happy. And then we knew immediately that we had to have one for the sample bottles that people use for essential oils. Oh, that came out of the lid. And these are a serious problem. You can't get them off. I've had people tell me that they use butter knives, that they use their teeth, that they use corkscrews. And all you have to do now is line it up and pop it on and it comes right up. This part of the key is countersunk, especially for older hands. So you can put it down and fit it right on. And you can push it in, and you no longer cover the airflow that lets the air in and out of the bottle when you put in the orifice reducer. So this just goes in, and when you push down, it comes off as easily as that. And then we had a request online that said, hey, we want one that does it all. Do you have it all together? And we happened to be creating one at that time. My husband designed this, which we ended up calling cheese because it looks like a piece of Swiss. And so this one will do everything. This will pop under and lift off the bottle top and this hole in the cheese helps you push it back on. The smaller hole <laughs> Lots of fun. There's the crescent there, lifts it off, and the countersink is there in the middle, and it pushes it back on. Now this hole is for a roller bottle that fits the same diameter as the sample bottles, but it's a smaller orifice, and that one will fit on that one and pull it on and off. So it will do sample bottles, the 10 mil, 5 mil roller bottles, and that other size that has a smaller opening. And for those who need it, um, the larger crescent happens to also work on essential oil bottles to open it easily. So you can get them on, and you just use it then to push it back on if you need to. It's very good for older hands. My Aunt Barbara, she prefers this key because it gives her more with her older hands and a slight feebleness in her fingers to actually be able to use it, push it on with a little more purchase to grip onto. And so that's why this key is also useful, though some of the younger generation love the cheese. And that's, that's it. That's all it is.